Hey everybody, we're going to do a color spotlight. Um, I have owned this color before, but it's been a couple of years. And um, the only time I had it was in a piece on my other, the first channel, the original channel. But uh, I don't know, I thought I'd take a chance on this one again. It's been a while. And I had pictures of myself in the other wig, and it was a straight style, so I wasn't sure how this would translate. This color is 22F16, also known by most people as Blonde Brownie. I did see a retailer who called this Pina Colada. I've never seen anybody call it that before. Um, but most people know it as Blonde Brownie, I do believe. Um, this is the non-rooted version of 22F16. And this is, of course, on January, the regular January. Uh, let me go ahead and show you up close. I hope this is <laughs> got this on right. 22F16. Pretty. Look at that. Okay, this is non-rooted, although it looks like it's got a shadow here, at least under this overhang. Um, I'll turn around, and then I'll tell you what this, this uh, particular blend consists of. When you see this, when you hear the description, you're going to think, hmm, that's interesting. <laughs> because if I had brought, and I intended to, but I, I have a hard time getting my equipment and my camera and watching out for the way I'm walking. Um, for the, those of you who don't know, I broke my leg in October and I'm just now getting to where I can walk without a walker. And sometimes it's a little difficult. You have to have at least one head free in case you lose your balance. So uh, I didn't bring the other piece out in the other color. But this particular color, the 22 F16, now usually when there's an F, it means there's a darker nape. Um, it's called fashion color. Now I don't know that this has, this may have a darker nape, but according to the word description, it says this is a blend of a light ash blonde a light natural blonde with a light natural blonde nape. So that doesn't sound in the description like it's telling you that the nape is darker. But let's take a look again and see. Do you see any darker under here? In any case, it's one of the very few non-rooted blondes that John Renault has. Not too many people have non-rooted blondes. And uh, it looks I think it looks very natural. Definitely a natural blonde. It's a pretty color. Pretty color. Um, if you were to see this next to, say, um, Palm Springs Blonde, this would almost look golden. But it really isn't gold. It really doesn't have any gold in it. It is definitely considered a cooler cooler tone. And I'm not sure how it's going to translate under this overhang. Hopefully I can get a picture of myself in the natural and out in the sunlight and let you see that um, to add to this video. But uh, yeah, this is one of the very few unrooted blondes. I'm trying to get close so you can see this blend here. You can see the different colors in here. But 22 is, I think, an ash blonde, and uh, 16 is a dark ash blonde, basically. So light ash blonde mixed with a light natural blonde, and then light natural blonde nape is what they say. That's what both sites said that called them called this by a different name. Um, so I had a hard time getting a handle on this color when I first got it. I had it on Christy in a straight style. I'll try to remember to put a picture of Christy uh, with me wearing it in this piece. Different lighting, I know, so you know it's, it's, it's a span of a couple of years and add different camera too. Um, I'll try to put a picture of Christy in this color with me wearing that up there so you can see it on straight style as well. But yeah, it's a really pretty light blonde. Um, if you don't like if you don't like rooted colors, they're just a little too much for you. I mean, look at the look at the the lace front on this. This is lovely, isn't it? Turn around one more time, and then I'm going to go get some pictures in natural light, or rather, 
sunlight. So there you go. John Renault's 22 F16 Blonde Brownie or as somebody said, Pina Colada. <laughs> Bye everybody.